Alright guys, Eddie from Taylor Fan Talk here again. A very hairy win, one nil, many many scary moments in the first half especially. I have with me here Ashraf, it's the first time I've seen him at the game, but Ashraf, I want to hear your thoughts on the game. Well, uh, Eddie, I think today's game is quite a very challenging one. Uh, the, the Rovers put up uh, a good fight, but then we still managed to pull through. But then a uh, 1-0 win is still something, uh, it counts as a 3 points also. So I'm satisfied with the win. Uh. Yeah. All right, I think that makes a lot of sense. So three points is a win, we move on, right? If the team needs to improve, the team needs to improve. Yes. Ashraf, tell me, who was your man of the match? I have to say it was Hassan Sani because he put in a lot of great saves, uh, kept the clean sheet, even though uh, there are some calls that were quite not going our way, but then still he managed to pull off some amazing saves today. And yeah, I think we deserve to win. Uh. All right, there were two disallowed goals. Frankly, from the stands, could you tell whether they were wrongly or rightly disallowed? Uh, it's hard to tell really from the stands, uh, but then um, I think... Some, Were you scared? Yeah, I, I was extremely scared <laughs> because one, one was it was a beautiful bicycle kick, but then unfortunately, unfortunately it was uh, disallowed, so that, that saved a lot of face for us. So other than that, yeah, it's a great, great win today. Alright, thanks Ashraf. We look forward to seeing you more in games. Alright, see you bro. See you. Thank you. Alright, Sailor Fan Talk again. Eddie here. I have Aaron with me. Aaron was a Home United fan last time. This is his first Sailors game in a very long time. Aaron, can you tell me your thoughts on the game? To be honest, I mean, um, the whole match, Tampines was were the better team. But in football, if you don't take your chances, and um, I think the penalty was a, quite a stupid foul to make. And at the end of the day, we got the penalty, we got a goal. So I would say it was a lucky three points, but a win is a win. So champions grind out results at the end of the day. And talking about the penalty, did your heart skip a bit when you saw it was a Panenka effort? <laughs> yeah, I mean, to be frank, it was a bit scary, but no doubt he's a, it's our top striker. So it was never a doubt that he was called a goal. Yeah. Okay, you talked about the Harry first half. Frankly, right, what do you think the scoreline could have been at halftime? I think if not for Hassan Sani, it would have been 3-0, 4-0 to Tampanis. But I mean, like I said earlier, if you don't take chances in football, then I think that's too bad. End of the day, we got the three points and that's most important in football. Alright, so I'm guessing your end of the match is Hassan Sani. Definitely. I mean, second half was a bit slow, but first half-wise, he was a man of the match and overall, I think, end of the day, his saves were crucial in the first half. So that was my man of the match for, for today. Alright, thank you so much, Aaron. We look forward to seeing you at more games. Thank See you, man. Yeah. Alright, so Sailor Fan Talk, we've heard from our fans, now you get to hear from me. I think, honestly, we're a bit lucky this game. We we were really lacking in the first half. I don't know what the problem was. They found a lot of space in midfield. They broke through our lines a lot. And Taufik Supano, for a while, looked like he was like a world-class player. And no slight to Taufik Supano, that shouldn't be the case. So really, I hope we improve. And next week, we're going to need that improvement because it's against Elberex. But you know what? We're confident. We're Sailors fans. We think we're going to win that. And we will not be as nervous this time. So let's go. Let's go. Come on. See you.